These are what we call our universal battery packs for electric vehicle conversions. And there's a few details that I haven't talked about before in some of the other videos I've made about them. Uh, the, one of the big things is that it is the smallest possible container we could fit a decent amount of energy in. And by decent, I mean these are 55 kilowatt hours of energy at 400 volts. There's other videos where I've gone through the details and you can check out the Felton site for full schematics and things. But basically DC charger input here, electric motor output there, auxiliary systems here, that's air conditioning, heater, charger, that kind of thing. Uh, and all the safety fuses, manual service disconnects, battery management, um, DC charge controllers, vehicle control units, all of these custom bus bars. This is able to be so small and condensed because there's no cabling inside here. It is all custom bus bars that the team in the UK have designed to make this the smallest possible footprint. And of course, that's important when we're trying to squeeze it in as many vehicles as possible. And by versatile, I mean that it'll mount straight into a 2009 Defender right here, or onto a series Land Rover chassis like this on these three mount points. Three mount points to allow for chassis flex, which these Land Rovers always get, particularly when they're off-road. And it'll also fit in the engine bay of something like this. And the important thing with that is it enables us to very quickly convert a classic relatively quickly, design a new system for different ranges of classic vehicles because we keep all the weight where it really was in the first place. So they have 320 kilos and it can go back where the engine was. But that is all of the electronics, all of the switching. We add a motor, we add a charger, we're essentially done. And that's why these are now shipping all around the world for various projects. We've got them in here for vehicles that we're building, to ship out to other customers who are installing vehicles. Um, there's a few more in the back and, and back here as well. Because they are so versatile and belong in so many vehicles and simplify that EV conversion process so much that it enables you in any workshop to get into the tuning and the customization and all the fun things around the specific vehicle. Not figuring out how to build a block of batteries to get 400 volts out of a plug. That stuff's done.